Here's the oil filter out at Equinox. We've changed oil in it probably four times. It's 2016. This filter here is crushed the least. It really looks pretty good until you get to about here. The other three filters, it's hard to imagine just how much they were compressed. It's just like you was to squeeze that and maybe compress that a quarter inch. And I know for a fact this was going where it was supposed to go. And we made sure that these cutouts was in a groove up into the cap. It goes like this. This is crushed the least. This is not bad at all. You, right here you can see the, the, the pleats in it are nearly vertical until you get this one area. And for informational purposes, this filter is, was the Bosch Distance Plus, number D as in Delta, 3324. Might be able to zoom in on that. Made in USA, big number here, DP, and the letter D, 3324. It's drained for a couple of weeks. We're going to spread the pleats out and see if we see anything in it at all under 250 power digital microscope. I don't know if we'll cut it open or not. A lot of times when you cut it open, you're going to end up getting quite a bit of debris down in here. This way it's untouched. And as far as the vehicle goes, it's running excellent. It doesn't use a drop of oil in 8,000 miles. And on this particular oil filter, the driver hit 0% oil life remaining going through Chicago. She had to drive another 200 miles to southern Indiana. So she's at 8,200 miles when we change this. And we'll see how it looks. And here's the oil that they ran in the car. Castro GTX Magnatech 5W30 as required. Of course, Dexos approved. Full synthetic. 8,200 miles on it. Did not use any. And the engine in this car is a 2.4 liter four cylinder. That's at 182 horsepower and 172 foot pounds of torque.